Hello guys, I am Shahzad and welcome to lecture number 6. Today we gonna access our PHP My Admin and we have already discussed that uh, accessing your PHP My Admin in light cells is very different or is a different thing from shared hosting. So now copy your IP, paste your IP here and uh, access your PHP My Admin. So now as you can see it's saying for security reasons this URL is only accessible using localhost okay if you want to open some other websites like Parktels or like insurance heaven and access your PHP my admin so now this is the shared hosting and uh, okay if you open the insurance heaven and uh, I'm saying this is the C panel It's redirecting you to the cPanel or, or if you access your IP and write the cPanel here so now as you can see it's not showing you the cPanel your cPanel okay wait for a few seconds so this is the shared hosting and uh, now if you access your PHP my admin Now as you can see PHP, you are accessing your PHP admin on URL. So now how can you access your PHP my admin? So you need few things to access your PHP my admin. Write find this software. It's a putty. Click on this. PUTY.org is the official account. Click on this. So now as you can see you have few choices you have to download two things first of all you have to download the MSI Windows installer I have the 64-bit operating system so I have to download this one if you have a 32-bit operating system you have to download this one so click on the software and now as you can see I am installing on the AWS I am saving or I have to keep this setup on AWS which we have created in your previous lectures click on this I have downloaded now I need to download one other thing which is the Putigen. okay so now 64 bit and 32 bit and also the 64 bit I'm downloading the 64 bit because I have a 64 bit operating system now open this one we have downloaded our key open this one putty generator okay now as you can see you have your putty generator okay now click on the putty generate and load and find your key so i'm saying aws open your all files as you can see this is your key now as you can see successfully imported now what you need you just need to click on the save private key click on this one are you sure you want to save this key I'm saying yes now I am key I'm going to keep this file here I'm saying my key my key okay now click on the save button so now as you can see we have just created the .ppk file okay you have to use the .pem file while creating or generating the .ppk file okay now just click on the installer next 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 i'm saying yes yes okay now i'm saying okay because we have just installed now go to your instance copy your ip address and paste your ip address here the port is 22 and also save your sessions and i'm saying load sorry IP address IP address and also I'm saying save 
so i am saying this is my current ip now go to your ssh and also click on the auth provide your key here which we have just created and now i am saying in the f drive i have aws and here is your key now click on the tunnel here you have to use the 8888 and also the local host local host colon 80 click on the add so go to your data and auto login username provide the bitnami as a user and go to your session click on the open so now as you can see yes okay it's fine so open your new tab access localhost colon triple eight slash php my admin so now as you can see you have just access your admin panel so click on this localhost by default is the root is your username and the password is which we have just copied from the click on this okay now this is your database or these are your database so bitnami wordpress so as you can see these are the tables available here you, you can also create some other tables or some other database from here so simply you cannot access your php my admin directly but you can uh, access your php my admin using this software and where you can download this this software so these informations available in the descriptions below you can also find them so i hope you are enjoying our series if you have any question or confusion feel free to ask me and uh, if you have not subscribed our channel yet don't forget to click on the subscribe button if you think we are doing good feel free to share our courses and videos so thank you for watching